Hello again my friends, the elusive sleeper simulant quest line is now active. If you found all four Dark Age relics and handed them into the gunsmith, you'll find the first firewall mission waiting for you on Earth. Completing this mission is just the first step in this quest line. In this video, I'll talk you through everything you need to do to get your hands on the sleeper simulant. So then, let's begin. Now during the first firewall mission, you'll notice that the Taken and Hive Knights spawn in a certain order. There are four waves and each wave has its own spawn sequence. Now this spawn sequence will help you a little later on in the quest. For the time being, kill everything until the boss spawns. Now this is the boss, Kandarak. He's not too difficult to bring down. When he falls, he'll drop a very important item, the Curious Transceiver. Pick it up and you're ready for the next quest step. Now once you have the Curious Transceiver, you'll need to examine it in your inventory. And this is where the night spawn sequence from the previous mission comes into play. Simply follow all the input commands you see here to start the next step in the quest. I've sped this up for your convenience. And as you can see, you now have the next step in the quest. You now need to complete the Shadow Call mission on Earth, and this is where things start to get really interesting. So then, this mission is timed. You have 4 minutes to reach the top of Devil Spire and kill 3 Taken Wizards. Again, I've sped this up for your convenience. My advice here would be simply run. Don't bother killing any of the enemies you'll encounter on the way. Simply run past them, unless of course they're blocking your path, in which case, slash them up with your sword. I'll see you at the top, Guardian. Now as you can see, you now have the Ikolos Fusion Core. Let's have a look at this in more detail. So then, this is the Ikolos Fusion Core and you have to repair it in order to complete the next part of the quest. So then, how exactly do you repair it? Well, there are five things you need to do. The first thing is to complete the Archives mission on Venus. The second thing is to dismantle any legendary or exotic heavy weapon. The third thing is to complete a Defend the Warsat public event on Earth. Then you need to complete a Defend the Warsat public event on the moon and then you need to do exactly the same thing on Mars. So then, let's do exactly that. This archive is amazing. Well done. Well done! Good work! So then, after completing all five steps, you now need to repair the Ikolos Fusion Core like you see here.
you now need to take the repaired fusion core to Banshee. Now, sadly, he doesn't hand you over the sleeper simulant. Instead, Banshee says he's going to hang on to it and show it to the city's foundries. In short, we now have to play the waiting game. My guess is that you'll need to return to Banshee on the next arms day to collect the sleeper simulant. I guess we'll just have to wait and see. And that, my friends, brings us to the end of the video. Thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe for daily Destiny content. And thanks for watching. You beautiful bastards. And as always, a dee hee hee. Until next time, Guardians.